Hello, my lovelies, Aquarius, my aqua sauce. This is going to be your week ahead, March 18th through the 25th. What is your central theme for the week? What does Aquarius or aqua sauce need to know? All right, eclipse in Scorpio, 32, regeneration. Stand firm in the eye of a storm. So what is it that you are going through this week? Let's see if we can get you some answers. So you need to remain flexible through whatever storm you might be enduring over the next seven days. What else does Aquarius need to know? All right, so you might be feeling a little bit trapped in a certain situation. Face your fears. I feel like this is a lot of negative thinking as opposed to actually being trapped, but it may feel very uncomfortable. I also think that you need to kind of check in with your higher self this week and see things in a different way. The, the Hierophant here is Taurus energy, so it could be kind of stubborn. Um, this is part of your spiritual growth and ascension. So there's a staircase leading up into heaven, into the ethers, and he's sitting there laughing. You might look back on whatever this challenge is and really laugh at it later. I feel like that's going to kind of fizzle out by midweek here. But at the same time, I feel like you might also be thinking about marriage, commitment, and your future. Know that there's lots of tests on this journey called life and that you can overcome most of them. You just need to stick to positive thinking. All right. Spirit's also asking you to contemplate your future. What direction do you want to take? Now is the time to start planning some of those things. You might be thinking about taking a trip, traveling, relocating. And so really this is asking you which path do you choose to take? For some of you, it might be going towards a divine counterpart with the emperor being out here. So I feel like this could be an encounter that maybe happens. I won't say on a whim, but I feel like kind of by chance. And I feel like it's a faded chance that you bump into this person or you meet this person. They also might be trying to make a trying to make a calculated risk. He is holding a chess piece here. Could be an Aries that you're dealing with. This is somebody who makes very wise, very logical decisions before they make an approach or before they go after something. But they try and go after something that's tangible, things that they can kind of conquer. It's a conquest for them. We also have the King of Cups. So there could be multiple people. Maybe you're trying to make a decision between one or the other. Somebody who's very devoted, very trustworthy, very connected to source energy, as well as their emotions. So I feel like a very balanced individual who could be a great partner. The Nine of Wands tells us that we might be very guarded. I feel like there could also be some issues between the two of these people if there's, you know, multiple options to choose from for you. And it looks like there could be with the Seven of Cups out here. Choose wisely. Choose which is going to be the best for you. I feel like you've been through the ringer already and you don't want to make a misstep. So the Seven of Pentacles tells us that the seeds have already been planted and that we need to give them what they need in order to grow. So good soil, water, sunlight, and and I feel like patience is going to be required. I feel like there's also frustrations around finances, work and money right now. And so we need to be patient while we allow these things to grow and it may take some more time. Part of this is the waiting game. And unfortunately, that's not very fun. You do have seven, seven back to back here. So that might be a number that you're seeing as well this week. And I feel like really you need to focus your energy on your spiritual pursuits, really invest some time with meditation or grounding and prayer or um, connecting to source energy and really contemplate the future and what that needs to look like. Choose wisely when it comes to love this week. You've got some big decisions it looks like to make. So follow your instincts and choose with your intuition. Have a great week.